All right, so let's first fix the problem we had with the uh, with the rifle. Uh, let's first, uh, if you still have it, delete the uh, shotgun. Makes it a little bit more easy to do this. Um, okay, so let's make a new child object in your uh, rifle. Uh, let's call this a model or, or a pivot or whatever position, because this will be the actual uh, position of the of the of the weapon. Um, then we're gonna copy over the uh, transform uh, assault rifle values and paste those in the model. Um, so we can set this one at uh, zero zero zero. So it resets back to the to the hand, and now we got the position inside the and the scale in the model instead of the assault rifle. Now open up your uh, shooter script for your weapon and when we equip the weapon uh, first we can say uh, for the muzzle we need to find it uh, model in the in the child of model because we changed the hierarchy of it. Now let's when we equip the weapon let's say transform so this is the weapon uh, we say the local rotation and position will be uh, zero. So this will be factor three zero and transform rotation equals quaternion identity. So when we switch weapon, we uh, reset the local position, the local position, and local rotation of a weapon. Now, if we run this now, the weapon gets switched to his hand and it's off right now. Uh, this is what, what we want, uh, or want, we, this is what we're going to change now. So instead of moving um, the assault rifle, move the model. So make sure you select the model and move the model into uh, place. Make sure you don't ex accidentally um, hit the uh, switch uh, weapon because then it will uh, cancel out. Okay, um, let's rotate it a little bit. So basically we're just resetting our view. Uh, you can fiddle with this as long as you want, of course. Okay, with this uh, in place now, let's make sure we copy the model transform and quit the game and paste the values in your model. Now the weapon jumps back to a different position, but what we can do, it's just a matter of uh, preference, you can position your weapon any way you want. So for instance, we can put him in his hand, but it doesn't really matter because we will reset it eventually. So we can, um, we could also uh, make any, maybe like uh, like this, set all our weapons like this uh, next to the next to the uh, players so we can see what kind of weapons they have um, so let's copy over the uh, assault rifle right now let's call this um, shotgun uh, change some uh, maybe the rate of fire to something lower uh, we, we, we will make, make better weapons uh, in a later uh, series. So let's see what happens now. So uh, if I move the shotgun, like so, when I, when I start the game, they get removed, the shotgun is disabled, and the assault rifle is in, the, in my hand. And now if I switch the weapon, it goes to my shotgun. I have a different uh, rate of fire, but uh, the weapon stays uh, in position the way we want right now. It's a little um, fiddling around, but I'm sure you managed to get it to work. Uh, see you in the next video, guys.